What is up guys, Floodmon14 here, and we're back to do the last two puzzles, Dual Hero, let's do it. Let's see if we can figure this one out. Da -da 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 -ba 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 -da -da. Win in this turn. Okay, so the opponent has 6k. Uh, something you should know is, I'm pretty sure Zombara can't attack directly, right? Can't, uh, okay, okay. So we're gonna have to do some shenanigans. Uh, Ojama Trio, hmm. Interesting, Ojama Trio. Okay. Well, I think you have to play Ojama Trio here. Give your opponent some, uh, some, uh, fodder for us to attack. I mean, because otherwise, uh, the Zombiras can't attack, right? Let's check out the rest of the hand. Ah, Necro Valley. Uh, Spell Reproduction. What's in the graveyard? Gift of the Martyr. Okay. Heart of Clear Water. Hmm. A-Forces would give... Man, it would give 600 to each Zombira. Big Bang Shot for Piercing. I don't think that would be enough damage, though. I think you... Okay. I think regardless, you do have to play Necro Valley and uh, Gravekeeper's Assailant. Because that's, uh, that's 2k right there. So you can use Gravekeeper's Assailant's effects to switch it, right? To switch its mode. Yeah, you can change the Right, right. I remember Assailant. Um, wait. 2k... Wait, 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 wait. What's this do? Equip monster 13 or higher automatically destroyed. Not destroyed as a result of the battle. Ah. Alright, so check this guys out. Check this <laughs> check this guys out. Yeah, check this out, guys. Spell reproduction. We take part of clear water. Wait, what? Why was that neg Oh Necro Valley negated it. Okay, okay, okay. I think we've still got this, guys, though. I think we've I think we've got this one. I just did it in the wrong order. Uh, surrender. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So we need to play uh, Spell Reproduction before Necro Valley. I was just like, what? I forgot Necro, Necro Valley negated, negated uh, graveyard effects. But, uh, okay. Otherwise, I think we were on to the right solution there. Okay, so what you want to do is Spell Reproduction first. Discard Taylor Fickle and Banner of Courage to take Heart of the Underdog, Heart of Clear Water. I almost said Heart of the Underdog. <laughs> uh, Ojama Trio. There we go. We're doing it right this time now. All right. There we go. Give him three Ojama tokens. And it doesn't matter which one you put it on, but we'll just put it on um, Ojama Yellow. Uh, just for being the most annoying in GX. <laughs> but I guess it was a necessary thing, you know, uh, for it to be Chaz Dual Spirit, of course. Necro Valley, there we go. Alright. Now we won't be negating our own cards. Gravekeeper's Assailant. And now, you, what you want to do here is use Gravekeeper's Assailant first. Uh, have it attack uh, yellow, but also activate its effect. Yes. Target very carefully the one that's equipped. Doesn't matter which one you equip, but make sure you attack the one that's equipped. Okay, so you do a flat 2000 there. There you go. Have, and then it can be destroyed in battle. So you run all of the uh, Zamiras into uh, the one that can be destroyed in battle. Very, very simple one. Very simple. All right. Well, we got that one pretty much right away. So, yeah. Yeah, it took me a while there, but... There we go. Good, good. You win. Sweet. All right. We clear that one. Good. So we only got one intermediate puzzle left. All right. Extra large. I'd like an extra large pepperoni with uh, extra cheese, please. <laughs> Man, now I'm hungry. Uh, two Megamorph. Wow. Okay. This one seems pretty straightforward. Blue eyes, of course. And giant red sea snake, huh? Okay. Well, I think what we want to do here... I think this one seems really straightforward, but I think we want to Megamorph our guys. Right. And then make our life points as low as possible. So Megamorph that one... Megamorph, um, Great White, 
Yeah, this one almost seems too easy. I guess you just have to know how Megamorph works. So, I think we want to throw Mystical Elf into Blue Eyes, because our life points don't really matter. We just want them as low as possible. So, yeah, throw Mystical Elf into Blue Eyes White Dragon here. There we go. That'll mean our life points are at 2200. Okay, and this should activate Megamorph correctly now. Yeah, this is at 36, this is at 32. So be sure to attack the blue eyes first, whatever you do here. That way, um, yeah, that way your life points will still be lower than your opponent's. So great white, attack blue eyes, shock, shock bait, ooh ha ha. All right, and then yeah, our points are double that of giant red sea snakes. So yeah, man, that last one was really pretty easy compared to uh, some of the other ones. Some of the other ones really uh, stumbled us. Uh, but yeah, that one was pretty straightforward. You just you just gotta know how Megamorph works, I guess. So okay, that wasn't too bad at all. Okay, all right, guys. Well, let's. Uh, yeah, let's exit, because with that, let me just show you guys. With that, all the intermediate puzzles are done, yeah. All 12. There we go. All right, so... With that, I guess we'll leave. And, uh, man, we're only at, uh, six and a half minutes in this video. So we actually, we actually have some extra time. I really didn't count on that, but, um, let's, uh, let's go to the house and save. And I'll change my deck real quick, and I guess we'll do uh, we'll do one or two duels to end out this episode. Um, yeah, didn't really count on that. But then, like I said uh, last episode, in the next few episodes, we will start grinding to basically register. I don't know if we're gonna register everybody, but we're at least gonna register like half the people we can register at this point, you know, with the uh, off-screen commentary. So, let's go with the Lester Soldier deck, I guess. Yeah, really didn't uh, count on doing any dueling this episode, but uh, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. We can do some dueling, we can do some dueling. I, I didn't expect to finish that soon, uh, honestly. Since some of those puzzles had stopped us, I, I expected that, uh, yeah, it would take it would take us a little while, but uh, uh, yeah, we finished. That last one was really easy, really easy. That probably should have been like one of the first puzzles in that round. Okay, so we got Mokuba there, Yugi Boy there. Let's, let's just see if we can get someone we haven't registered. No stars, not a duelist. Ah, one star. Who art thou? Rex Raptor. Let's do it, buddy. I made the semi-final splash tournament. I don't jump. My raptors will ravage ya. Go, Kielosaurus. All right. Let's do it, Dino Boy. All right, we'll go with the tails there. All right. Guess we get some duels in after all. Let's do it, Rex. All right, and giant germ glued to our hand. I love it. And we only got one. We only got one. I special summon Gila Swords in attack mode. And I sacrifice it. Prepare to meet Megazower. <laughs> uh, how was that, Rex Raptor? I think that was pretty good. We'll go with Spell Absorption. And I'll set giant germ. And I'll set uh, this tornado, I guess. All right. Your turn, Dino Boy. Let's see what you got, Rex. Now prepare for my mad sword beast. This monster has piercing when it attacks. Man, we're going to take some massive damage this turn. But it's okay. We got Lightning Vortex and Sinister Serpent back in the set. So. Not to worry, guys. We'll be just fine. Take the 500. Special summon. Now I get two more giant churns, Rex. Alright. Kill Megazowler! Stop that weak germ! <laughs> uh. In deck, that is correct. All right, we draw. Well, 
like I said, it seems like a good time to do this. Lightning Vortex. Discard Sinister Serpent. And looks like your monsters are fried, Rex Raptor. No, my back is out Alright, we'll go with Junamas. Valkyrie. And Battle Time. Alright. Giant Germ Attack. Poison Sludge Attack. Man, this thing does look like a poison type. If it was, in, if it, if it was a Pokemon, Giant Germ would definitely be a poison type. Dunamis Valkyrie. Light of Justice. Hey. Alright. And with that, Rex, I end my turn. Da -da -da -da. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Go! Two-headed King Rex! Time to stomp ya! Raise body heat, that's a good call. It'll boost him by 300. But if you attack my Dunamis Valkyrie, I've got a surprise for you, Rex. Uh, what do you attack there? I gotta see just to check here. Uh, what did he attack? Okay, he went for Giant Germ, so you know what? Uh, I'm not gonna play this Tornado yet. Not yet, Rex, not yet. Had to make sure there. Kill two-headed King Rex, stop that germ! Alright. Seeing a lot of iconic Rex cards in this one. Alright. And he's gonna end his turn. Good. So we get back Sinister Serpent. Ooh, White Magical Hat. That's good. With that, we'll be able to draw a uh, discarded card out of Rex's hand. So, yeah, let's do it. White Magical Hat. Now I play Dust Tornado Rex, and with this, I'll destroy your Raised Body Heat card. Alright, Battle Fox time. Go, Dunamis Valkyrie, Light of Justice. I think uh, Yami Bakura was the only one to play White Magical Hat in the show, but it's a pretty good card. Now go, my White Magical Hat. Send his monster to the graveyard. And now I'll activate White Magical Hat's special ability. When this card does damage, you discard a card to the graveyard. <laughs> Let's see what you discard, Rex. Ah, your crawling dragon. That would have fused with your two-headed king, Rex. But it's too late, for now that monster is gone forever. Okay, and this duel is won. He just straight up ended his turn. I don't think we can do exactly zero, so let's just attack. Let's just attack. Good white magical hats. Attack his light points once again. <laughs> I'll be discarding another card of his Rex Raptor. Now let's see what you got in your hand. Ah, what was that? A magic card, eh? Ah, another raised body heat. Unfortunately for you, you had no mucks that is summoned because I got rid of your crawling dragon last time. <laughs> there we go. You win. Right. And let's show the max view. Ah, only 66, so yeah. Alright, Rex, what do you gotta say? I, I was taking it easy on you, seriously. You're a chump. You're a chumposaurus. Okay, and we got a new duelist there. Uh, let's not look around the map. Let's just duel whoever this is. Oh, it's Rex again. Today is Rex Raptor Day. Yeah, I know chump. My raptors will ravage ya. Rex Raptor, round two. No items, final destination. My two headed King Rex will stop ya this time. <laughs> All right, Rex, let's do it, buddy. All right, and this will definitely be the last duel of the episode. So, if you guys are liking the episodes, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. As usual, Go Wasteland! This will give all my dinos a 200 point boost, and I special summon Gilosaurus once again. Is he gonna do the same thing? Tribute for Mega Dollar? Go Sword Arm of Dragon! That's not quite what he did, but pretty close. Man, we got a stacked hand here. Check this out Pot of Greed, Sam Instruction. I activate Pot of Greed. This lets me draw two cards. Uh, the Crush card. Stepping ground. Smashing ground will destroy. 
destroy your dino. Ah, good riddance. And now I summon my force reader in attack mode. <laughs> ah, adhesion trap hole. You know, that's kind of perfect, Rex, because as you guys know, or maybe you don't, adhesion trap hole makes our monster have half the points it does, making it perfect for our deck devastation virus. Thanks for helping me out there, Rex boy. But now, go, Force Reader, attack its life points now. <laughs> Use your mighty axe to slash his life points. All right, Rex, I end my turn. What are you gonna do, boy? And let's wait till he summons, cause his monster might get boosted. Oh, okay, now it's just tie him. All right, not a problem, Rex, not a problem. Now, check this out, Rex. I activate my Crush Card Virus! <laughs> now I tribute my Horse Raider. Say goodbye to all the powerful monsters in your head, your dick, and your field. Your dick's about to be destroyed. Oh, but that's not all, Rex. Now that my Horse Raider's gone, I'll play Call of the Haunted to resurrect him. Come back, my mighty beast! Force Raider, return from the graveyard! <laughs> All right, and thanks to us playing Crush Card, we know he's got, um, what you call it? We know he's got, uh, Deck Devastate, I mean, um, uh, Adhesion Trap Hole set. So let's just activate it. Let's just have him activate it. Yeah, on, uh, Dunamis Valkyrie there. Okay, then we'll play, he's got no cards, but we'll go ahead and play Card Destruction. Since we got Sinister Serpent, draw a couple cards. Good, good, he has no hand, so. I'm very glad we did it in this order. All right. Go, Pulse Raider. Attack is Taiho number two. Oh, no, wait. This is just Taiho. Why is this card even in his deck? It's not a, uh, it's not a dino. It doesn't get the boost from Wasteland, and you can't even search it out with Giant Rat, so... I guess just to make Rex a little easier, since you can find him, you know, pretty early in the game. But, uh, yeah, I really don't see the reason for Taiho in his deck. Uh, unless it's just, like I said, just to kind of throw you a bow and make him not so bad. Ah, so he's got polymerization, huh? That's not going to do you much good, Rex Raptor, because you've got no cause to fuse with. I draw. Plus, you can say goodbye to that polymerization card. For now, I once again summon the white magical hat in attack mode. <laughs> and what's he got in his graveyard? What spells? No spells right now. Okay. Well, we'll set Grave Robber anyway. And it's time once again. I can't believe we got this card in back-to-back -back duels. Go, White Magical Hat. Attack us life points directly. <laughs> and just like last duel, Rex, my White Magical Hat will send a card in your head to the card graveyard. Force Raider, attack us life points again. <laughs> Dunamis Valkyrie, Light of Justice attack. <laughs> Alright, you got one turn left, Rex, and this duel's over. I am my turn. Now my Crush Card Virus will send the powerful monster you've drawn directly to the graveyard. Looks like it's over for you. Alright, so he's got 1650. Yeah, I don't think we can do exactly zero, so let's just, uh, let's just wrap it up, shall we? Go, white magical hats. Attack his light points once again. <laughs> there we go. Luckily for you, you have no cards in your hand, so I can't send anything to the graveyard. Go to Navas Valkyrie, light of justice, in this stool now. Lawrence is back. <laughs> Alright, and that's gonna do it for this episode, guys. Alright, show you guys the points once again. Uh, no damage and battle damage only, so you get 76 points. Alright, I, I wasn't taking it easy on you, seriously. Hey, if you say so, Rex. Alright, guys, we'll head back home here. And I want to... Let's check the mail, too, before I end off the episode. No new mail. Okay. 
That's fine. Alright guys, I want to thank you all for joining me. And uh, yeah, next few episodes, look forward to... Uh, and um, maybe I'll break it up a little bit. Maybe I'll do like... Uh, you know, like five or six episodes without commentary, and then, you know, a couple with commentary. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but definitely, um, uh, regardless, from uh, registering everybody, it is going to take us quite a while. Uh, it really just depends. Uh, you know, some people take longer to register than others. So I don't know exactly how many episodes it's going to take. Um, but one thing is for sure, uh, we will get a lot of uh, KCP, KaibaCorp points, from all of the registrations, so um, I don't know if I'm going to cut in for commentary, like, because uh, um, I definitely will cut in for commentary at some point, because um, we will get a lot of KaibaCorp points, and that'll let us buy a, a lot of packs. So, yeah, I may just do, like, five or six episodes with uh, without commentary, and then, you know, cut in and do a few packs, and then, you know, a few more without commentary, and then, you know, cut in and do some more packs. So, um, and also, there are, of at this point in the game, there are quite a few new duelists, mostly shadow game duelists, that we can run into at this point. Um, so if we do run into, like... A new duelist we can do uh, we can do duel against what I'll do is I'll save state and then I'll just uh, yeah I'll cut in with my with my phone and I'll and that way I can kind of talk about them and uh, what kind of deck they use in this game and stuff uh, but, but yeah uh, that's the plan for the because for the next few episodes, and that's good, because, uh, yeah, well, you've already run into, like, my Kaiba and, um, Rebecca, so I think it's mainly just the, uh, the Shadow Game duels that'll be new for us, um, but yeah, that's, um, yeah, look forward to that, guys, next, um, but yeah, I hope you guys are all enjoying this, but that's the plan for the next, you know, for the next few batch of episodes, uh, but yeah, thank you guys all for joining me. And I will see you all. Oh, I did it wrong. I will see you all. There we go. Next time. You guys all have a good day.